For cheap Minecraft hosting, be sure to go ahead and check out Clovex.net. What is going on guys, Casual Savage here, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to preview another video on your second monitor in Sony Vegas Pro 11, 12, or 13. Just before I get into this video, if you would like to request a tutorial on Sony Vegas Pro 11, 12, 13, Photoshop, After Effects, or even Cinema 4D, then be sure to leave it in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. Now I'm saying that because this was a requested tutorial, got this asked me on Twitter as you can see, so don't be shy, just ask me what you want. So it's very simple to do and let's get into it. You can see I've got this little video here, it's just a sample video. We're going to click properties, disable for example and uncheck maintain aspect ratio as always. And now the previewing, it's very simple, come to this button right here, right click it first and then come to video preview preferences. You'll be presented with this right here, ignore everything here, come to preview device. And now here you can choose what device it runs on, I'm going to have it on my graphics card. And here you choose what display you want it on, and now if you don't know what display is which, simply press identify displays, it'll tell you which one's which, so this is one, that's two. So I want it on number two, and you can see it's already selected that number two. And then here you can choose what you want. Settings are usually the best how they are, so it's up to you again. And then this part right here, keep it as use project settings. Simply apply and OK. The next thing, if you press this video preview on external monitor, as you'll see, we now get the preview up here. So if we just flick through, it's going to flick through there as well. And you can see if we just play it, it's going to play on both screens, there and here. So it's a great way to edit, and it's very simple to do. However, there's also another way you can do it. So to get rid of the big screen, press ESC, and there we go. And you see these buttons here? You can simply drag the screen onto this side, and just pull it out like this. And as you'll see, you now have got all this room to do your editing. So you got all this stuff and you can edit here like so. So it's good for big projects you have to do and it's very simple to do. So yeah, that is it for this video, a very simple tutorial and like I said at the start of the video, if you would like to request a tutorial on Sony Vegas Pro 11, 12, 13, Photoshop, After Effects, or Cinema 4D, then be sure to leave it in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. With that being said, be sure to go follow me on Twitter, I'll keep you updated what I'll be posting and what I'll be posting. Also be sure to go and check out my technology news channel, I'll keep you updated on the latest technology news. And finally, be sure to go and me on Snapchat, or just sure they do throughout my day. So if you have a here, thank you so much for watching, please subscribe, rate, and peace.